right. So we are done with this application. That's the best part. And now we will do some black box testing. Let's do it. So let's check for the Emirates. We have done it a lot of times. So let's check if he has. Let's see if we have three flight number. Okay. So we do have in, it's in air and it will land in two hours. That's great. Let's check for Qatar. 242. Do we have something for this? Great. It's scheduled in eight hours. Perfect. Let's see for yesterday. Okay. It landed. Arrival time is 2nd December. This is Doha time, or I don't know, it's Doha, no, it's Turkey time, it's local, and this one is the universal time. So it landed 13 hours ago. So that's great, we are getting both of these information. Let's check for scheduled one. Okay, great, takeoff time is on 3rd December, 8.15, this is the local time, and in a day. This is what I told you about moment. This is not very accurate. It will give you an estimate. So if you want to get an accurate date, you might have to use another library. There are a bunch of libraries out there and I will share which library is accurate. Okay, so now as we saw that this application works, this was not a very small project. This was a medium project though it we are not storing anything it's just not even displaying the weather information but this is a good project to learn api and it was interesting so if you guys like this series and this video do like our video share it with your friends and subscribe to our channel and also, it would be really helpful for us if you can tell us what do you guys want, like what projects do you want in the future, and if you have any recommendation, do let us know. Thank you very much, and see you in the next series. Bye-bye.